The visiting American Hollywood star Terence Howard has concluded his countryside tour of Uganda. And don't forget the mask, because the moment we reach the chimpanzee, we have yeah. okay. 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 Flanked by Minister Frank Tumwebazi and Uganda Tourism Executive Director Lily Ajariva, Terence Howard has been at Kibali National Park. Hey cousin. <laughs> the park is commonly known for chimpanzee tracking, especially by foreign tourists. Okay. I don't want to be near that thing when it comes trying to do its thing. Yeah, this was a guided tour. These ones, when they don't have alternative, then they come to eat this, such that the stomach can get <laughs> You can see, you can see all the types of the monkeys, but so far we've got one. We have the buffaloes, we have the elephants, but majorly we defend ourselves against the forest elephants. Mm -hmm. So you're going to see many footprints so around it, here. When you shoot it against, it will run away. Yeah, yeah. you disorganize yeah. it and first look so to, to, to go. Then meanwhile, for you, you are taking another direction. The visiting team was amazed about the beauty of this Uganda's untreasured nature and wildlife. Let's get back there and we. Oh, back to we our keep path. checking uh, along the trail. So we're going to go back through yeah. the vegetation. <laughs> <laughs> and shit, I told you we didn't need to go through there in the beginning. The Ugandan government continues committing itself in preserving nature and wildlife as well. What is very unique about Uganda is the diversity. We have too much, too many of that we cannot just sell one thing. We can't just sell the mountain gorilla. As much as we have the largest population, we can't just sell Renzori. We can't just sell the source of the knife. We can't just sell the weather. We can't just sell the, the culture. We need to understand the diversity that Uganda has. When people come here and tour, they eat our eggs in the lodges. The eggs employ farmers. When they eat cheese and butter, they employ the dairy farmers. So Uganda is a marvel to the world. We all need to market it and, and complement UTD and other government agencies and, and our embassies. To have here Terence Howard, you could have gone to any other park in the world. But Tourism in Uganda is one of the top income generating sectors and with such foreign exposure, there is no doubt that the future is bright. Robert Nyango and Sharon Chomugisha for UBC News.